All right, what's going on, everybody? God bless you. Just coming back with a real talk video. Um, a lot of y'all ask me, what are my thoughts now um, on George Zimmerman? You know, because he stay in the news, always in the news. And uh, I said I wasn't even going to do no more videos about uh, George Zimmerman, but my thoughts are still the same as I said from the first video. You know, this man is getting away with so much, but he will not get away and escape God's judgment. Sad enough, yes, we lost Trayvon. Not a day go by, I don't think about what his mom and his daddy is going through. And it's sad. And every time I cut on the internet or I look at the news, I see George Zimmerman. He got stopped again speeding. Now he's all over the news again because he done got into it with his wife. Or finna be divorced wife, we could we should say. And his father in law done punched this man in the nose and you know, threatening and all this kind of stuff got his hand all on his gun. I was looking at my boy True Speaker video and this young lady, I can't think of her name at the moment, but God bless y'all. Um, nothing but truth in y'all videos. Nothing but truth. As, as the days go by, we can see that it's been like this for a while. When it comes to the judicial system, Something ain't right about it. It's been like that. And so many people that's crooked, they always get off, you know. And when I think about what this man got going on in his life, and then here go the other thing, they didn't press charges. Why didn't they press charges? See, it's something else behind this George Zimmerman. Somebody getting paid, we know that. Whether the media ever say that or not, See, I didn't fall off the back of no truck yesterday. I know what, I know what's going on. See, I done been through the, the system, and I know what goes on with lawyers and judges and you know DAs, D whatever, whoever's involved in it. I know how people get paid. They pay their way out of stuff, and, and the ones that's really innocent are the ones that's really suffering and 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 locked up and having a hard time getting justice. And to see this man. George Zimmerman doing what he do all the time with his arrogant self. It, it don't amaze me. <laughs> it don't. So my thoughts are still the same. It ain't no justice. It's just us. And before you know it, he gonna be nothing killed. Let me say it right. He gonna be nothing murdered somebody else. Because to me, he didn't kill Trayvon. He murdered. That's cold blood murder. He murdered a young man who was minding his own business. And had he been minding his own business, Trayvon would still be living. Just my, That's what I, I believe that in my spirit. That young man would still be living. But you always got a fool out here that got something to prove, trying to be something they not. And it, it, it's so many Trayvons that have been killed. You just don't hear about it. And their name might not be Trayvon. Something seriously um, will happen to people like Zimmerman. Trust me, that's why I say he wouldn't. I'm like my sister and true speaker. He will not escape God's punishment. And see, I don't even. I don't wish. I don't even wish bad on my own enemy. Some of y'all will catch why I say that because there's so many people that have changed and will change. And some won't change. I don't even wish prison. I don't even uh, wish the penitentiary on my worst enemy. But see, prison is better to be in prison than to feel the wrath of God. I always tell people, that's why when you look at jail, you look at jail and then you look at the penitentiary, big difference. It's way worse off in the prison. I always say hell and lake of fire. I look at jail as hell, but I look at the penitentiary like the lake of fire. You got death row in there. You got some that's going to die. So you can get out of jail. You can post bond. But there's some folks in the penitentiary 
they ain't gonna never get out. They gonna die in there, and some have already died in there, and some more gonna die in there. And if George Zimmerman ever go to prison and run into some black folks, that'll be his first and last day in prison. They would have to have some show enough protection around Zimmerman. But if you keep looking and watching Zimmerman, and the sad thing is, he probably will never do a day in prison. But at the flip side, he probably could. You know, just my little old two cents. It don't mean too much. I'm just answering a few questions. So with that being said, y'all, I'm going to get out of here, man. Got a few things to take care of. Let's keep each other lifted up. I'm praying for you. You pray for me. But I don't want everybody praying for me. Because some of y'all like to pray evil, wicked stuff on your boy. That was for my haters. But to the ones that I love, even though I love my haters, let's keep each other lifted up in prayer. Don't let everybody pray for you. And don't let everybody lay hands on you and speak mess in your life. Peace.